Hello and welcome everyone. Thanks for tuning in. In this one we're looking at more huge anomalies I discovered on Mars. I discovered these potential megalithic blocks in the southern mid-latitudes of Mars, just to the south of Terra Chimeria about four years ago. Let's have a look at those again. The high-rise photograph in which I spotted this anomaly is called surface morphology, acquired on the 19th of December 2007 at 49.5 centimeters per pixel resolution. The image I cropped from the JP2 black and white map projected file. There's a look at the low res black and white and the corner of the anomaly is so huge it actually shows up in the low res as well. So the site is to the south of Terra Chimeria at roughly 76 degrees 54 minutes south, 159 degrees 13 minutes west. Here's the anomaly at 1 to 1 scale, folks. This side of here measures about 200 meters in length. Check out the uniform thickness to this block and the straight edges and right angles. Unfortunately, that is the only part of the block that was photographed by the IRA so far. This block shows up next to a larger one in a MRO context camera photograph. And there it is at one to one scale. Unfortunately, context camera photographs are taken at very low resolution. So we can make out the smaller block that appears in the high-rise photograph right there on the right and then this one next to it approximately 600 meters wide and there we can see the well-defined edges of that block just shows the difference between the context camera and the high-rise camera remarkable resolution there so let's have a look at the monolith on Phobos. This is from PSP 00776990015. And this photograph was taken at 5.8 meters per pixel. There's the monolith right there, folks. It's about 23 meters wide. And there's a zoomed in view. Unfortunately, if I zoom in any further, the image breaks up quite badly. And there we have the two blocks at one to one scale. So if we place that block inside here, it would take up at least a third of this circular depression. Alternatively, if you place that little block on top of these, you won't even notice it's there. So we're looking at huge blocks here on Mars, folks. And here's the monolith depicted in my Mars Explorer 3 game. Can you imagine placing those huge blocks next to this monolith on Phobos? It would cover the whole horizon of here, I'm sure. Right, let's head on down to that site. We have Terra Chimeria of the Afax to the top and then the photograph in which we see the corner of the one block surface morphology right there. Let's zoom in and take a closer look at those two blocks. So we can see the larger one measures about 750 meters wide and the smaller one about 220 meters wide. The question is are we looking at intelligently designed and manufactured items? Just like the huge ship that I showed you guys in a couple of videos ago and the huge tower-like anomaly. 
Something rather strange happened on Mars, that's for sure. Let's have a chat in the comments below. Look forward to reading your thoughts and analysis as to what we might be looking at here. The evidence points to huge megalithic blocks manufactured on Mars, possibly even on Phobos. So are we looking at an ancient megalithic civilization that once thrived on Mars? And why the huge blocks, the huge tower, that huge ship, they did things on an epic scale, that's for sure. To my new subscribers who just joined, welcome on board. Take care everybody, I'll see you in the next video. Ciao for now.